in one word. Terrific. I'm impressed. I'm really impressed with this lower rod, the size of a quarter. Carbon fiber, big. I have no, I didn't have no idea it was going to be like that. I was thinking some little wimpy thing, but it's big. I don't know what the salt wave action is going to do to this mechanism here. I guess only time will tell. Wash it out good all the time. Oh, you should be okay, I guess. Other than that, that's the only thing I didn't really, uh, I'm not too excited over. And uh, of course, five pounds is five pounds, and they say it's balanced good, and it, it is balanced, but I think after three or four hours, my arm's going to say, hey, five pounds. Yes, I read. But we have to see. We'll give her a spin tomorrow. Stand by. I haven't hooked up the wireless part yet. I tried it out in my yard. I only had it about an hour. And I got my gray, my uh, black widows on there right now. It works fine with him. You can cut that switch off right there. It cuts off the whatever that switch does. Volume is good. Screen is bad, and I, I will say the screen is bad in the bright sunlight. With sun, with polarized sunglasses on, it's bleak. Bleak, bleak. Hard to see. Because I didn't get a chance to fool with the backlight. Somebody said if you turn the backlight off, I'll do that tomorrow in the morning when I test her out more. But it's a uh, pretty good heater. Initially, pretty good heater. Well, I overslept a little, but I'm headed out. It's a little after six. I got a new heater set in my truck. I'm going to take my uh, blackwoods. And I'll uh, see you in a few minutes. Beach is crowded at uh, seven, a little before seven. And the tow ships, they're out here taking pictures of the tall ships. Which you'll get to see uh, what I did yesterday. Okay, we're getting ready to put the heat on here. Heat on. Like I said, the screen is hard to see in the daylight with sunglasses, with polarized sunglasses. I see what they mean by the rainbow effect now. It's only with polarized glasses, a big rainbow on the screen. That's not very cool. I guess I'll have to live with that though. Stand by. Gotta turn this module on now. I'm going in. I'm thinking bottle cap. That's what it sounds like to me, a bottle cap. Stand by. You see the tall ships on this side. They get ready to sail into Norfolk now to port for the Harbor Fest weekend. Tall ships. Well, the first cargo was a big iron stake about a foot long. Second target is a nickel. I couldn't tell you where it read. I can't see it with these sunglasses on. But that's a nickel. Sounded good. Sounds just like my SE Pro. I didn't see no difference. Stand by. Now, that's a really low sounding target here. 1201. I'm thinking a piece of foil, a piece of aluminum. Reading far left hand side. Near the bottom.
11.01. Stand by. Second target is a lot, but it's 10.24. Got an inch or two deep. 10.24. Lot. We got lots of nice rocks out today. Look at them. Ain't no big one. Also rock. Stand by. I don't see anybody in the water at all. That makes me nervous. I think the bay is probably closed for bacteria. It was has been the last two days. I didn't even check the sign, see if it was up this morning. They close it every once in a while for high bacteria count. We'll see if we can find a sign in a minute. Real solid 1222, 1224. Says it's four inches deep. Stand by. Solid 1224, full tab. Ring style, full tab. 1140. No, 07, 1241. 1241 solid. Three inches, four inches. Automobile. Sports model. Stand by. 68. 14. 12, 18. That's jumpy. 12, 17 seems to be the best of it. About six inches deep. Now it says 16, 16, 10, 16. Stand by. Piece of aluminum. That's why I guess it was iffy. He was trying to tell me it was a piece of crap, but I wouldn't listen to it. 1214. 1214. It's uh, four inches deep. Stand by. 041, 0141, 0139. Says it's uh, four inches deep. 0141. That jumps between that 1048. 0141 is the best of it. 0141 appears to be a belt buckle, maybe. It looks like a belt buckle. Or some kind of square aluminum piece of crap. Said four inches deep, that was four scoops deep. A solid 1225. Four inches deep, 1225. Stand by. 1225. Nice aluminum, nice. Now we got a knockout 1215. Knockout. Three inches deep. 1213, 1215. Ten thirty, eight thirty, nine thirty, twelve thirty. Twelve thirty seems to be the best of it. Can lid, jar lid, twelve thirty. Five scoops deep. 1224. Three inches deep. 
Aluminum. I'm thinking aluminum. Stand by. Fine. Fine, ticket. Fine. 1201, four inches deep, high on the left side. Really low, fully sound. Let me see if I can get this to work in sound so you can hear it. Stand by. That's too much trouble. Stand by. Well, it was low and fully. A really thin piece of cruddy aluminum. That's a different sound. I don't know why. In some aluminum. I guess because it's so thin, I think. Hmm, the job of the day. Grass raking in front of the hotel. They could rake grass for two days. It's as far as I can see is grass. In every direction. Have fun, my friend. And drink a Dos Equis when you get through. That started out as a 01 something, then it jumped to 05, 01, 05. I'm talking about the first number now. But it was good and repeatable, you know? There it is, right there. Eight feet deep. After I got about four scoops off of it, it was reading 12 something. I forgot now, whatever pennies read. Deep, deep penny. Good repeatable sound, but the numbers were screwed up. Until I got some sand off of it. So far, I'm impressed with this machine. Impressed meaning, it seems the processor is pretty fast. Kind of reminds me of my S75, and that's what I was hoping. Uh, I've adjusted the shaft out three times. I got it out long. I mean, it works good for me long. I'm short, so my shafts are normally short. But I got this baby maxed. It ain't maxed out, but it's pretty close. And it's a uh, nice balance. Everybody was right about that. Five pounds, but I, it's hard to tell it's there. And I'm the first one to tell you I was really negative on the five pounds, but so far I'm happy. I got it, uh, you know, in a waterproof mode. Arm cup is okay with me. I do see the uh, rainbow effect, but I got sunglasses on. I have a screen on. We can still see it all right if you move around a little bit. We got to keep going here. Stand by. Sound now. O nine seventeen. Twelve eighteen. Twelve eight. Ten seventeen. Seventeen thirteen. Best of it seems to be 12, 13. Same target. Stand by. We're in 11, 17 now. 12, 13. I'm about 18 inches deep. I ain't going any deeper. I might try one more scoop. That's it. Well, one more scoop it was. I don't know how many scoops that is, about 14, 15. I don't want no more like that though. Look at that damn hole. I know there's a Chinaman down there somewhere hollering, help, help me, Chinaman. Holy Toledo. Now we got another odd one. Eleven thirty-eight, seven thirty-six, three thirty-five, oh one twenty-three. The best of it seems to be oh nine thirty-nine. It's something deep. 
God, I just dug China. Stand by. It ended up being a kind of a thick piece of aluminum, maybe a burnt beer can bottom or something. But it was only one scoop deep. She likes aluminum. I'm at manual 22. And threshold 21. I'm in a stock beach mode. I'm at uh, noise cancel manual 11, which you'll never change as far as I own it, I don't think. It might, but I doubt it. Volume gain 18, threshold level 21, volume limit 15, threshold pitch 12. I don't know what all that means, but that's where I set it at. Go does in pitch hole. I don't know. Going back to the lane tonight for a low tide, 6 o'clock low tide, so I'll probably go down about 3. I'll go home and read some more on this, this chicken right here and see what I can find out. Stand by. Well, I heard some comments about the coil cover being flimsy. And this is the coil cover off my SE Pro. It's flimsy. But I never used it, so I, I can't say anything above and beyond that. This one is seems much sturdier. It don't shake as much. It seems to be a smidgen thicker. But that's just a, a guess, you know. It, it just seems that way. I don't know. I ain't going to measure it. It just seems that way. That's all I got. Stand by. Well, you see most of it. I didn't end up with a nickel that you saw, a dime you didn't see, and three pennies. I don't think you got to see them fine tickets. I got two pieces of beach glass. You saw the car, the bottle cap, this lock of sort. Belt buckle. Oh, hell, there's a penny hiding in the lock. I didn't see that, baby. But that's what she likes right there. That aluminum. Look at that little teeny tiny stuff right there. Like I said, I don't see no difference in that in my SE Pro or my E-Track when I own one. They, they all liked it. It's just part of doing business in the beach. I'm going back for, like I said, low tide this afternoon about 3. I think low tide's at 6, so I'll give her another spin. Stand by. You see how long I got it? That's long for me. God. I am going to change out my headphones. I've used my black withers today. And like I said, they're nice and they knock out all the noise, but they're heavy and hot. I'm going to take my, uh, where the hell are they? My Explorer, I mean my SE Pro. I use, uh, here, no, they ain't them. Where the hell are they? I'll have to follow the wire around to find them. Now oh, here they are, hiding back here. I'm going to put my Jolly Rogers on. I got to take them out of the box. They're plugged in right down that clam. Put them on, they're lighter. And got the gel ear cuffs, so they'll be uh, more comfortable. I'll have the gel ear cuffs on the uh, black widows, but I'll have them. I'll have this baby on that in a little while. Okay, I'm going inside. See you later.